Hi everyone, welcome to Vishnu's online classes. So we are going to start online chemistry and physics classes for NEET on regular basis from 15th August. So for that one sample video, lecture video I want to give. See let us discuss about addition reactions in organic chemistry. Addition reactions, types of addition reactions. So there are three types. One is electrophilic addition reaction, nucleophilic addition reaction, and free radical addition reactions. So three types of reactions in addition reactions category. So let us discuss about first one. Electrophilic addition reactions. Electrophilic addition reactions. So, which undergoes electrophilic addition reactions? Alkenes. readily undergoes electrophilic addition reactions why alkenes only undergoes electrophilic addition see alkenes are having one sigma bond and one pi bond between two carbons so these pi bonded electrons are loosely held electrons so whenever we provide electrophile to this alkene Immediately, this pi bonded electrons attacks on electrophile to form a carbocation first. So on this carbocation, again from the reagent, nucleophile will start attacking so that finally we will get an alkane derivative. So, here it is a nucleophile, here it is the electrophile. So here alkene converted into alkane derivative, alkane derivative. It is also having specific name based on the electrophile and nucleophile. So in this overall reaction, sp2 hybridized carbons converted into sp3 hybridized carbons. In addition reactions always at the cost of pi bond, one pi bond two new sigma bonds are generated around the same two carbons. So what are the electrophilic addition reactions examples? So examples, first one is hydration, hydration means addition of water, addition of water. So for this addition of water, the reagent used is H plus by H2 or they may give dilute H2SO4, dilute H2SO4 in presence of H plus, anything they can give. So both represents addition of water only. So why these addition reactions, alkene addition reactions are called? electrophilic addition reactions. So first uh, species attacking on the reactant is electrophile. That's why it is electrophilic addition reactions. So water if you add to the alkene in presence of H plus, in presence of H plus. So double bond will remove, will write two new sigma bonds around olefinic carbons. At one carbon, we have to write OH at another carbon H will write. So here these are the alcohols will get. Alkenes to alcohols. Alkene converted into alcohol. And mechanism if you see. Mechanism of this hydration reactions. C double bond C. First attacking of H plus. So this H plus is taken by one of the olefinic carbon. Another olefinic carbon gets positive charge 
here h here it is like this carbocation is formed so this is the intermediate carbocation intermediate is formed on this carbocation intermediate nucleophile water attacks this is having plus charge here this carbon is attached with hydrogen so now h2o h2o will attack so attacking of nucleophile that leads to formation of like this positive ion c h last step deprotonation so oh h2 oh h2 loses 1 h plus from this it loses h plus to form oh here h so finally we'll get alcohol in this addition of water first electrophile is attacking so it is electrophilic addition and the carbocation intermediate is formed intermediate is formed so depending upon stability of intermediate we can decide the reactivity order of alkenes so alkenes reactivity order alkanes reactivity order depends on depends on stability of carbocation intermediate stability of carbocation intermediate intermediate okay now let us see which forms readily stable carbocation that alkene is said to be more reactive ch2 ch2 ethene ch3 ch ch2 propene ch double bond here it is ch3 and here you write two ch3 groups as the number of alkyl groups increases so stability of carbocation increases and this will be highly reactive compared to this this is more reactive which is substituted with four methyl groups so reactivity order if you want to find we have to see the stability of carbocation so this one forms highly stable carbocation after adding h plus we have to see after adding h plus as in the first step i have shown so here the carbocation formed like this which is tertiary tertiary carbocation highly stable so the alkene which gives highly stable carbocation is said to be more reactive in electrophilic addition reactions now in this addition reaction we have to see one more also in case of symmetrical and unsymmetric symmetrical alkene means the alkene which can be bisected into equal halves that is called symmetrical alkene this is symmetrical this is also symmetrical this one also symmetrical okay these are all symmetrical alkene in symmetrical alkenes no need to follow any kind of rule while adding h2o but in case of unsymmetrical alkene unsymmetrical alkene we need to follow markovnikov rule so which are said to be unsymmetrical alkenes first of all ch3 ch double bond ch2 this is unsymmetrical ph ch ch double bond ch2 this is also unsymmetrical so in case of unsymmetrical how we should add h2 in presence of h plus h2o addition 
So for that we have to take reference of olefinic carbons. And we should not forget that rearrangement also possible. If these are the olefinic carbons H plus by H2. So after adding H plus there are possibility of two intermediates formation. One is this intermediate by adding H here, this H plus. Second intermediate is CH3, CH plus CH3. So this is secondary carbocation, highly stable. Primary carbocation, less stable. So more stable one will give major product. H2O we are adding. If you add H2O on this, will get alcohol of this one as a major product CH3OHCH3 from this we'll get minor product so minor product is obtained from less stable intermediate major product is obtained from more stable intermediate so this is major and this one is minor This formation of products in case of this compound. So major is this, major is this, minor is CH2OH, primary alcohol you will get PH, CH, OH, and second CH2, CH2OH. So this is minor product. In overall in this addition reactions, what we have to follow? Markovnikov rule we have to see. In this Markovnikov rule, the olefinic carbon attached with lesser number of hydrogens. Lesser number of hydrogen. In the middle carbon, less number of hydrogens are there. For that we have to attach nucleophile. What is the nucleophile here? OH. That is major. Okay. Whereas we can say in another way also, during addition of an electrophile or in electrophilic addition reactions, the nucleophile must be attached with olefinic carbon which is having lesser number of hydrogens or positive charge must be attached to the olefinic carbon which is having more number of hydrogens. More number of hydrogen, this carbon, positive charge we have to attach it to this negative charge nothing but nucleophile we have to attach it to this okay so by following this rule we can write the products also suppose this is the compound this is the compound and we are adding water to this h plus by h2 so first uh, skeletal structure as it is will write next uh, in this oh h plus we are going to add h plus we need to add here oh will add here Another product which is minor, that we can write like this. H is here, OH is here, but this is minor. Since we are attaching the negative charge to olefinic carbon, which is having more number of hydrogens, here zero number of hydrogen. So this is major and that is minor. Okay. That's all students. Thank you.